We have a heavy law enforcement uh, presence uh, moving in uh, south of Park Rapids at the uh, Shell City Campground, uh, the site of uh, Line 3 uh, protesters. A uh, video here from, as they call themselves, the water protectors of Hollywood actress uh, Marissa Tomei speaking a bit earlier today at that uh, protest site. Winona honored me with showing me around and showing me the, the ways that uh, things can change uh, into a more sustainable way of life. And she's putting boots on the ground and making those changes uh, with solar panels and other and hemp and other very tangible ways of doing things along with our prayers and our actions. So uh, this, is, this is my thank you and uh, uh, statement about uh, what needs to be changed. I'm grateful to be here today, as you know, on the lands of the Anishinaabe people at the Women for Rivers rally. <laughs> the indigenous leaders and the water protectors to call on President Biden and White House National Committee Climate Advisor Gina McCarthy to revoke the permits that the Trump administration issued for the Line 3 pipeline, conduct a comprehensive review of the impacts that this pipeline will have on the treaty rights of tribal nations and the impact on the water, the land, the air, the climate, and stop line three now. Now, that was earlier this afternoon on this Thursday. As of 4.30 p.m., we're listening to uh, uh, police traffic. It sounds like a heavy police presence moving into the area, uh, maybe involving as many as uh, 70 protesters, and I'm not sure exactly what they're doing, but this is near the uh, Line 3 construction site, so uh, we'll keep you updated as to what happens here. I'm Neil Carlson reporting for inews.tv.